welcome back to another 5 minute showcase with your host Builder Bear. I'm Builder Bear and your 5 minutes starts now. We're in warp ES4 or Elemental Springs the 4th looking at a build from one of the one of the old builders, one of the OGs, Yami on World of Corallus. Uh, I put in the chat, I said, hey, somebody give me a build to come showcase. And Yami's like, bro, TP to me. And I was like, bro, I'm TPing to you. And I was like, dude. He's like, dude. And I was like, dude. He's like, dude. It's like, this is the one, bro. So anyway, I'm here. This is a really cool build. It's a modern build. Uh, ES4 is kind of a mountain theme going on here. Some beautiful trees, amazing landscape. And you got a little sneak peek at one of my favorite parts of the build back there. But this thing is tucked back into the landscape and it looks awesome so we're gonna start at this crazy nice gate first of all i love the uh the bush the like the big bushy hedges that he has going on here with the gate kind of in the middle opened up with all these signs just saying hey come on in and check it out and go over the signs really quick uh look at there's mr spouticus i do the videos on walk to with him clean f you know what that means. I'm not going to say it. Stop trying to get me to dirty up my family channel. It's by TCL. Yo, this hits hard by Builder B. That Builder B, he seems just to give the best, the best signs ever. All right. I love it by Milo. Oh, what does this say? Subscribe or die. Do it. All right. Going up the driveway. Uh, I like all of the... I don't know, it seems hidden. It seems a little protected and kind of back in, you know, back away from the road. And that's really cool because it's, I don't know, it's a little bit of privacy. And if I was going to design a house for myself, I would definitely give myself a bunch of privacy like that. So we're going to go up here. Yami Chatan. Yami, how do you say your name? Oh, uh, this thing's called house, by the way. Wop, wop, wop. Love. All right, ooh, look at the red door. This is a hint of things to come. There's a massive colorful tree in here, and uh, Yami has put hints of the colors from that tree all throughout the house, along with some other splashes of color. Love the tree when you first go in, and I really like this lighting fixture, actually. That is a dropper, um, just kind of surrounded by some trap doors, and actually, it looks really good. I'm using Silder's Medium right now. Normally, I use Silder's Extreme, uh, but it was taxing my computer, so I decided to use Medium. Coming to the bathroom, this big giant green wall, again bringing some of the outside in with these massive, just in your face bits of color. The red right there behind what I assume is, I'm guessing this is the, the laundry area. Back to a, like a guest bedroom with another beautiful splash of color. Really simple design, got a ceiling fan in here, some furniture, and I love it. I really, really like it, and I like how the um, the rug kind of plays off the blue on the side with a little bit of the sun and sky color going on. All right, coming through here into the living room. The thing that I love about the living room, two things. Our map plugin gives us insane um, pictures we can use, and that is a beautiful picture on the wall, very industrial. And then, dude, this fireplace. Look at this fireplace. When I was first flying through here, I really thought that that was fire in a glass... A stained glass block and I almost lost my mind. I was like, how did he do that? I thought it was another moment with the stairs and the water. No, it's behind it, but it really looks like it's in it and that's really well done. Uh, coming back through here, um, very simple kitchen. I'm guessing he meant to have something on the backsplash right there. It's not showing up right now, but I love the lights coming down through the ceiling and it, again, the overall ambiance and the warmth of this place. Then coming through here, you have another bedroom very big very open and i really like how the master bedroom is its own master like suite like it's its own house really cool tv design on the wall with an actual picture my favorite part of this bedroom um, besides the skylight up there is this closet i love how the closet is really just tucked away in there and i love how it's the stripped texture really just warm and inviting and then another bathroom in here with just very nice features very normal we're going to get to my favorite part for this last 40 seconds, and it is this tree that is just hovering over the house. Look at that tree. Look at just how vibrant in autumn it is, and it's not built. This is inspiration, dude. This is why we do these videos, because, like, look at this thing. It is not even leaf blocks. It is just so beautiful and in your face, and I'm not sure if he built it or if he got it from, like, our slew of trees that we have available here. Here. But dude, coming out and seeing that tree hovering over with this beautiful red like wall right here and eating in this beautiful courtyard in
and hanging out here. It's something very cool about it and very serene. I'm down to four seconds. I used way too much time. I uh, love this house. Good job, Yami. Ugh, I gotta go by.